everybody. Thank you so much for stopping by the channel. I am here to do your pick a card reading. This is your next 48 hours for the general collective. What's coming your way? What do you need to be aware of? If you'd like a personal reading, I do offer that. I'd be happy to help. Information is under the video in the description box. I do have your dailies, your message for your daily tarot. That's going to be in the shorts. So just go to the section that says shorts and you'll see your dailies there. Okay, so pile one and we're going to use this deck. Pile two and pile three. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. Okay, for pile one that chose this deck, I hope you're all doing well. Let's go ahead and take a look for the general collective, your next 48 hours. What do you need to be aware of? What's coming your way for the next 48 hours, please, for the general collective, next 48 hours. What do we have here? The Hierophant, okay. We have the Lover's card, Four of Swords, Page of Swords, Ace of Cups, Knight of Pentacles. Okay, so what I'm feeling and what I'm hearing here is the Hierophant is institutions. Okay, there's a lot of challenges and changes with that. Rules, regulations, institutions, jobs, structure. Okay, it could be a school, it could be a business, it could be a bank situation here. But underneath that, you do have the Page of Swords. Okay, so this is telling me in the next 48 hours here, you could have a little bit of conflict here or somebody could be jealous, somebody could be spying, somebody could be watching you on your job. Uh, you could have a little difficulties with paperwork, documents, things in that nature here. I do feel that it's going to work your way, but I do feel that there could be some challenges and changes. You may change your mind and, you know, you were going to take that job, but then you decided not to at the last minute. Whatever it is, you do have the partnership and you do have the Ace of Cups. Okay, beautiful. So for some of you, you do have a huge offer of love coming in. It's very emotional. Could be a water sign. Could be Gemini here. Um, we could have Taurus here as well. But there is a huge offer. Now, a partnership with the Lover's card, it could also be business as well, especially when I have the Hierophant next to that. You could be falling in love with somebody here at work in the next 48 hours. Somebody could be crushing on you at your job, around your money, how you make your money. Or it could just be a new offer if, of a job, of something that you love to do. You want to get the hell up out of where you're at. So you're going to be saved, we'll say, by the universe that an offer is coming in in the next 48 hours here for you. So there is some type of partnership. There there is an offer coming in. It does have rules and regulations here. You do have the Four of Swords, and you also have the Knight of Pentacles. Slow and steady wins the race. You've been waiting for a while, okay? You've been really trying to hang in there, do your thing. But the Four of Swords, you know, you're just... This is home. This is solid foundation. This is security, all right? This is sustainability here for you. So whatever it is, it's going to go at an even pace for you. It's something that you've wanted for a while. You do have the Ace of Cups. It is a beautiful offer coming in. Could be love situation. You know, you could be with... Um, water sign with an air sign here. I do have fire energy here. I feel fire here. You do have a lot of air signs. There's a lot of communication. There needs to be a decision made. Slow and steady wins the race, but you do have some type of offer coming in. You're going to be really happy about it. There has been some challenges and changes. Things have been a little slow, but they will be moving quickly, and they do actually go in your favor in the next 48 hours. Let's move on to pile two. Okay, for pile two, that shows that deck right there. Let's go ahead and take a look at your next 48 hours for the general collective. The next 48 hours for pile two, please. The next 48 hours, what's going on? What's coming their way in the next 48 hours? Okay. I've well, got three cards right off the bat. We do have the Nine of Rods. We also have the High Priestess. We also have the Four of Pentacles. Somebody's not been telling the truth, either you or somebody else. There's been a little bit of discord here in the next 48 hours. The battle's almost over. The struggle is literally almost over. Whatever the situation is, if it's being done to you, there's been some secrets here. It's a higher power. It's a higher knowledge of knowing. Okay, the High Priestess holds the Torah, the Scripture. Okay, so she knows things. She doesn't tell everybody everything. And you have battle here, right? So the wounded soldier, if you will. So it's almost over. Whatever the situation is, I do feel there's a secret that's going to be revealed. You're going to find out about either somebody else's stuff or your stuff is coming out. Somebody that's been not telling you the whole truth and nothing but the truth. Somebody's been holding on to something very quietly, very firmly. This is the Four of Pentacles. You've been holding on too much, too tight. It's almost like smothering, like almost like a lack of not having enough. But whatever the situation is in a job situation, there's been battle, there's been confusion. Uh, maybe your boss is not paying you what you're worth. You're holding on to as much as you have. Whatever the situation is, this battle is going to end very soon. Let's look at the rest of your cards here. Yeah, you have the knife. Wow. 
Okay, it's kind of heavy. I'm going to pull an extra card for clarification. Okay, pile two. There has been some anxiety, fear, depression, just worry, obsessive worry, whatever it is, it's over money situations. Like I said, that lack of, if you go back and watch that, look, you have the four of pentacles to the five of pentacles. Holding on to something because of lack of, not getting what you want, not getting your worth, just fearful that you're just not getting enough attention. It's not working out for you in a relationship, love relationship, business relationship, because we have the coins here. So whatever the situation is, the battle's over. I feel for some of you, because it's a general collective, you're just done with this crap. You're just leaving. You're just like, I'm done worrying about not having enough or not getting my respect, my honor, my whatever. I'm just the hell up out of here. You may walk away at lunch and not come back. I mean, you know, I've heard it. I have many clients. Clients. And, you know, I can tell you, yep, mm -hmm. when you've had enough, you had enough. Everybody has a button to push, okay? So, with that being said, here comes the secret with the Queen of Pentacles. There is a job for you. Somebody's actually going to offer this for you. While you're just about ready to walk out, somebody steps in, you get a phone call, a text, or somebody in that building offers you something else to come over in their department. Whatever the situation is, there is something that's coming in. It does work out in your favor. You are feeling this lack of right now, but in the next 48 hours, you are going to be blessed with something. Let's pull this out here. Five of Rods, wow. Okay, there's a lot of competition. There's arguments. There's a lot of discord here. I'm going to leave it here because you're being saved here. Whatever this is that you've been going through or this competition, whatever it is, you end up with the Queen of Pentacles and the High Priestess is coming in. So there is an offer coming in here for you. Let's move on to Pile 3. Okay, for Pile 3 that chose this deck here, your next 48 hours, let's go ahead and take a look. The General Collective, what do they need to know? For the next 48 hours, what's coming your way, please? Spirits, guides, guardians, angels, what's coming your way in the next 48 hours? Knight of Wands, something's coming in quick. Five of Swords, Two of Cups, and a partnership. We have the Four of Cups. We have the Page of Swords. Oh my goodness. And we have the Five of Cups. Wow, what is it with this energy? I know we have the, the full moon in Aries coming in on the 21st. So there's a lot of action, a lot of fire, a lot of power. Somebody's angry here. You may be angry about something that's not going your way. I do feel that you don't have to worry about the battle, especially in a love relationship. I'm going to take the top row first, okay? So you do have the Knight of Wands. Your ship literally comes in. I mean, something's coming in quick towards you, okay? And there's been a battle here with the Five of Swords. Look at that. Somebody walked away, but at what cost? Did you get the last word or did they get it? And did it really matter, right? So whatever the situation is, he's coming in with his wand. He's going to take action. I feel like it's like saving the day here. Whatever the situation is here for you in a partnership, because I have the Two of Cups, it could be some hella stuff going on at work, okay, or with your business or your online business or competition with online business and things are like stale, stuck, not moving or whatever the situation is in a partnership for you, love and or business. There's been a struggle. There's been something going on here, okay, but something's coming in quick here. With that being said, you're bored. You're like, oh, I don't even know if I want that, okay, because you have the Four of Cups to the Knight of Wands. Something's coming in, but you're still bored about that situation. Could be third party situation, Three Cups down one cup up but look universe the little cherub is saying look just come and take this stop doing pity party on you just come and take this this is so much better you've been asking we're trying to give you something it's right here but you still may not really like what they're offering whatever this is page of swords you have the message okay to the five of cups you're like yeah well maybe i should take that because you do have the five of swords you have the five of cups you have the four of cups the two of cups you have a lot of cups it's a lot of communication so this may not be your ideal dream job but it gets you the hell up out of whatever this is this relationship here okay you're just really you're holding on to this right here you haven't even let it go you're holding on to old baggage in order to get to the new you got to let something go somebody is trying to come in and offer you something there could be a reconciliation you may consider about going back to that you may not could be an old job could be an old lover but there is a partnership that there's a little bit of conflict in again if that's business or love for you whatever the situation is you do have something bigger better more coming in yes it's not everything that you want but it's better than where you are i hope that helps take care